Oh, 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 not a cloud in the sky today. What's up guys? How's it going? Mark Green 408. I'm losing my dog. Oh, come on. Here you go. Yeah, she doesn't listen to me. Come on. All right. Um, game plan. So we got a ton of footage on the weekend mudding. So I kind of just been posting that throughout the week. Hope you enjoyed it. I want to obviously do more because those videos always do super well. So I'm excited for that. We got some big projects on the go. It's just taking a lot of time. So I'm hoping sooner than later, the whole lockdown and fricking all that crap is not very handy. It's kind of making things take longer, but hopefully soon. So anyways, we got the F-150 here. Um, Yankum is sending us some more ropes, some bigger ropes. Come on, all. Come on. There she comes. Yeah, Yank, I'm sending us some bigger ropes because I want to pull some bigger stuff with my truck. I don't know if you guys watched the uh, the semi pole there. Nah, come on. Come on, girl. <laughs> she hasn't been out here in a while. She's excited. So usually when it gets hotter out, I kind of bring her out, but she's not a big fan of the heat. She loves the winter. So when I'm outside roasting all day, she doesn't like that. But right now we're going to pick up a car. Jay just called. He needs me to move a lawn tractor real quick. What good timing, eh, as I'm coming to get the trailer. But I'm picking up a Ford Escape today. And uh, yeah, it's super hard to get cars right now. I've been posting a ton of ads. No one responds to my ads because they want way too much because there's too many scrap people in the business right now. So, but I am finding a few. So uh, yeah, let's get this thing loaded up or locked up, loaded up, get the car, drive in 30 circles today and get her going. Come on, now. come on. Hey. Oh. Oh, there she is. <laughs> She's pumped up. All right, let's roll. That's Chase in the truck. We're running out front. Go away. Run, Nella. Run. <laughs> no, the, the attack dog versus Mini Me over here. <laughs> Oh, we're starting early. Got the race. Who is what is this? A Jeep? Race Jeep? Don't run him over, Jay. <laughs> Not even watching where he's going. He's trying to look good for the camera. Hey guys? Oh. Hey bud. They see me rolling. They hate him. Now, come on, come on now, get out of there. <laughs> oh, you got a lift kit on that thing. Oh, Nala, just loves being in the country. All right, let's get this back to Jay's house and go pick up that car. Now locked up over there. Are you giving me the finger again? Abby. <laughs> yeah. I know your father is over there. Yeah. Can you hawk the horn? Hey, me. Where are you gonna drive this thing? You wanna hit a jump? You wanna hit a jump? Should we hit a jump? No? <laughs> Should we mow the house over? Yeah, let's do it. All right, let's see these backing up skills with a roller, Jay. That's for, that's forward. R for race, R for race. Good thing it's empty. See the ultimate jackknife. Up, oh, set my alarm off. Where's my key? Nope, someone's breaking into my truck. Up. Oh. How light's this thing? I just pull on it? There. That's the lightest. How are you gonna roll with that? <laughs> Gotta fill her up. Nah. Probably trying to eat something. Like an old pro. 
All right, let's go uh, pick up that Ford Escape. What was that? Oh, hey, no problem. I'll send the invoice in the mail. <laughs> oh, man. The way gas prices are going, might have to pick up that electric F-150. I'm excited. They announced it this next week, this week. Let's start rolling everyone's lawns. Classic players. At least your seats come out easy. So what are, what are you doing here? Well, <clears throat> I'm changing. Well, I gotta do U-joints, so I got three of them, but I'm replacing the carrier bearing. So this whole shield literally runs the whole length of the vehicle up to here. So it's like half the vehicle. Oh, okay. And I gotta cut it out. Jeez. Or else, if not, I gotta take all this stuff off. I'm like, I'm gonna cut it out. <laughs> yeah. Where's the new one? In the Super ATV box. Super ATV saving the day. There's a whole bunch of parts over there. Oh yeah, there's the freshie. Little billet. Nice. Then we got some some evil parts still. Or is that your old clutch stuff? That's the old clutch stuff. Okay. Everything's the machine that they sent. Yeah, so Evo. And she works good. Evo has boosted up this machine, got her 200 horsepower. We got the launch control. It makes it go pop, pop, pop. Clutch kit. Yeah. So there's, they're the same company that does my Maverick too. So I'm at 200 horsepower with the launch control. Let's make that thing 200 horsepower. Pat, pat, pat. At least it's not pink. Yeah, true. Like that color? Everything's pink. Oh, someone's at Doris de Gaulle. It's a nice day today. Oh yeah, look at that. There, look at that. Oh, no, no, she's happy out here. Just eating grass. Come on. What are you doing? Anyways, beauty day. She's a lot warmer than it was yesterday. I think it was only seven degrees yesterday. I mean, it looked like this, but it definitely was not warm. I cut some grass out here and had to wear a winter coat, but we got this thing back, the old escape. These things are always rotted out on the back. It's insane. But uh, yeah, even the back on this. Everything else looks decent. I wonder what she looks like underneath. I got a fresh pipe on her. A little rusty. Let's take her for a spin, see how she does. Wish she would have filmed that. She just launched right up in here. Ugh. This is the only vehicle that you're allowed to sit in the front now. Because I don't care. It actually smells really nice in here. I believe it was owned by a girl. Let me just throw a seat back for you. There you go. There. You can lick snot and pee all over everything in here. I do not care. Oh, we got some low tire pressure. Almost half tank of gas. Uh, how do I, how do I do dash stuff? Where's the okay button on here? Oh, here we go. 337, 174, that's uh, higher than usual. Usually, usually we get them around 250, 300. Brakes sound good. I don't know if you guys can hear that. All right, ready to go for a rip, Noah? <laughs> uh, kind of hard to stand in here, eh? She's got lots of pep, though. How's it going, Noah? what you get for rolling and horse shit. <laughs> oh man, that doesn't sound good. Yeah, you like it. She loves hanging out with me. All right, floor it. Holy, holy guacamole. She is a fast one. We got a bit of a graveyard going down here. We got half a Sierra. We got a Jeep that I might just blow up now because it's pretty much screwed. We got the other half of the Sierra. We got the Cadillac that I'm gonna blow up. And we got this nice Equinox. So maybe uh, maybe I have to have the guys out tomorrow we'll do a race. How you doing over there? <laughs> oh, she probably just wants to run. I should have let you run beside me and tire you out. Maybe I'll do that. All right, hop out. 
<laughs> She's like, I'm out of here. F you guys. Ugh. All right, we'll park this one for now. We're going to head over to Brad's, help him unload some wood, and then I think tomorrow we'll continue the video. So, Oh, look at that. Nice little cat. Let's roll. All right, she is go time. New day, new us. We just got down the track. We got Mr. Johnston here. What's going on? So I'm thinking, I'm thinking we blow up. I got a guy coming to pick up the Jeep and the two-part Sierra today. So I'm thinking we blow up the Jeep. We put some, I got some bullets. Where'd you put them? We got uh, a bunch of 22s and a 50 cal here. We're going to have to jam that one in a little yeah, extra. Hard, yeah, but... spit on it and jam it in there. So I'm thinking we blow up the Jeep because she's not running too well, so you can't even jump it. So we'll blow that up, and then we'll take the uh, freshies for a run. We got an Equinox and a all-wheel drive Ford Escape, and you and I both know Ford Escapes are fast. Also, when we go to jump the Ford Escape, you know, next week, Someone, I don't know who, but thank you for the comment. Someone said we should cut all the doors off, take the seats out, cut the hood off, make it super light, because when that thing jumps, yeah. Because remember, remember we jumped that Jeep way back when? It was stripped already, and that thing flew. It was two-wheel drive, it was muddy. It was a leap year, election year, and that thing flew. Hey, you got a DeWalt uh, Sazzle? Yeah. We'll cut the top off. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> All she'll be is a steering wheel, four tires, and an engine by the time we're done with it. But yeah, we're getting rid of that today and this and the box. So let's, uh, actually, I guess I got to park over here. And uh, yeah. Yeah, pull bullets, that thing up. your burning truck, probably yeah. not a good idea. No. So we'll tip her out, we'll drain the oil, put some bullets in it, and let her fly. Here we go. All right, here we are. So yeah, we'll flip her up, drain the oil, fire away. Yeah, this is her. Split her right in half. Yes, we did give it a little help on that side. Some people got angry about it, but you know what? That's fine. Yeah, but this one I did not chop, and it freaking ripped it pretty good. So, yeah. I'm scared there's uh, there's that thin metal in that. Together. It's crazy, eh? And yeah, we should have took the gas tank off so we could drive the front part around. Maybe on the next truck. That would be awesome. That would be hilarious. Put her in four by and freaking let her fly. Look at the trailer out of this. I know it's pretty balanced too. Like you can. Actually, you haven't. Oh, hey, there's my clevis. I was looking for that. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, there you go. All right, let's flip this thing up and drain the oil. So we got the Yankum hooked up. We got a fresh Yankum coming, actually, because I beat the hell out of this one. It's time for a fresh. She's still, she's still good, but obviously, you know, we get ahead of ourselves sometimes, and You'll put it up, it'll be wrapped around something, might hit a sharp edge, and I just, you know, it's, it's time for a fresh. And we actually have a bigger one coming, because I want to tow a full 120,000 pound semi. No problem. Yeah, no problem. so we're just rocking out with our freshie DeWalt radio. Obviously I have to turn it off because we can't have music playing. So anyways, let's tip this thing up, and uh, yeah, see where we end up. Yank them. This thing upright. We are attached to a seatbelt. No, no problem. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think stretch. Up. Almost. Perfect. It's safest if you keep it on the balancing point. Then she's got no way to tip back on it. That's right. It looks like it's going back the other way. So but yeah, as you can see, there's that cut. Not a big deal. Yeah, I accidentally cut it. Obviously, that was my fault. That's not the Yankum's fault. It hit something sharp. And we have this permanent knot in it from Jeez. last year. So, but other than that, I've towed probably you know 100 cars with this thing. We towed the semi. We towed that big blue van. And we have beat the hell out of it. I pulled that uh, that friggin' Chevy out of the snow in the winter. So well, you pulled something way back in the bushes over oh, there yeah, at one we point too. Oh yeah, Mitsubishi. Yeah, we've done it all, flipped it all, ran over it a million times. So this thing has done well. Highly recommended. There is a link below with a discount code if you guys want one. But... All right, let's drain the oil out. Let's check this thing out. Yeah, yeah, so I chopped the cats off there. See, now, now it's safe. I can just push it. That's right. Yeah, I'll just drain the oil, go get my oil, oil bin over there, and then we'll fire this thing up and uh, 
Let's get some bullets. Caesar. You like you guys like Caesars? Because she's gonna she's, we're gonna Caesar. <laughs> I think this battery is a little overkill for this drill, but twice as much as it is. Yeah. Mmm, yummy oil. Better drain, better drain. There we go. A lot of oil in this thing. All right, let's blow this thing up. Drain the oil. What's that? Drain the oil. Let's see how long this thing lasts. Should run for a while with bullets, I think. Oh, yeah. Practically a lubricant. Good old NoCo, saving the day as always. All right, fire it up. Ho, ho, ho! I forgot to cut the cats off. <laughs> what? All right, shut it off. Uh. <laughs> Holy. So just want to stir it up real quick, get the last bit of oil out. <laughs> Look at that, eh? Nice little lift kit. All right, I'll pull forward, put the bucket out, and throw some uh, throw some bullets in there. Let's do this. I got gotcha. you. Where's it going? I'm actually smart now, and I, I bought a fire extinguisher just in case. No one likes car fire. I mean, I do like car fires, but not on our property. All right, get a bunch of those bad boys uh, in there. Oh. Yep. Pour them in. Force me a nice big yeah, there we go. Put that 50 cal in, and uh, yeah, let's uh, let's get this thing started. Are you ready? Pull the fire out. Yeah, maybe pull the fire extinguisher out. All right, who's gonna put it to the floor? Brad. I know. Where's Brad? What do we got here? Muffler, perfect. <laughs> Obviously, there's a governor when you put it in park or in neutral, so we have to lift it up oh. and uh, get the back tires off the ground so we can actually go wide open. Perfect. With this thing. So I'm just trying to think how to do that. We'll lift one side with the anchor rope and then we'll lift the other side with the anchor rope. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's think this out for a sec. <laughs> We're thinking now. We don't even have to lift it up. It's gonna cut the drive shaft. We forgot about the whoa, whoa, you're good. Yeah. Forgot about the door. I don't like the door anyway. Nah. The door can eat it. Well, that's your safety latch now. Yeah. Exactly. So Sounds stressed out. Time. Yeah, we're getting smart here. We're yeah. just cutting the drive shaft off. We're just gonna cut the drive shaft. I don't know which blade's which now. Where's, where's my metal ones? I wish all the paint didn't wear off these blades. What do we got? What do we got? What's that one? <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, 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 baby. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Just need a battery too, eh? Running out of batteries. Where's all my batteries? On the friggin' charger. Always. Okay. Sorry, radio. I'm stealing your battery. Alright, let's do this. I wouldn't recommend lifting your vehicle like that's not very safe. This would not be Brad approved. No. Go. <laughs> Better back down, do it again. 
right, and drop this again for the third or fourth time. Do this. How long is she gonna last? I'm gonna say 45 seconds. Just once you get her revved up. Just, I'd say a minute and a half. That drive shaft's just gonna be slapping. Oh yeah. Hope you like your ears. Be like a ride at the fair. Yeah.
Just like that. No flames, no bang. I could have sworn that was going to be way quicker. I mean, there's no oil in it. We took the plug right out and we filled it full of balls. So, you know, I have to say Jeep is on the, the higher end of engines. They definitely last longer. Yeah. I think our longest lasting ever was like a Ford Escape. It went forever. So, well, that's it. That's all. So anyways, let's, uh, let's get the Ford and the Equinox going and uh, let's do a little race. I like Keep that. This video I going. like that idea. All right. I just found this key in the box of the Sierra, the other half of this truck. And of course I can't even get in here. Hold on. Give me a sec. He's trying to see if the key works for this, but we can't get the damn door open or the window broken. This is complicated. Chevy, you can rip them in half, but you can't break the window. <laughs> oh, <Holy> jeez. <laughs> <laughs> All this to see if the key works in a truck with no half. Break it from the inside out. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> nope. Nope. I mean, I do have a pry bar. I can just pry it open. Your second career in stealing vehicles is uh, <laughs> not a good idea. That's why I didn't make it and got it in 60 seconds. There Love you it. go. <laughs> All right, what's it gonna be? Oh, ten bucks. Ten bucks to you. There you go. Nope. Not the right key. Okay. I don't care. That. We're fine. It's fine. I'm fine. Perfect. So, yeah, she's dead now. The rope worked good. She didn't snap, but definitely on its way out. And this, again, this was my fault. This wasn't the Yankum's fault. And uh, it's still holding up. Like, like it's still holding a lot of weight right now. It's about half cut all the way through. So. Well, you've been up and down on it. It's been bouncing. <laughs> yeah. And I can't even remember if it was cut when I was pulling the semi last. Or I think it happened when I was pulling that. It was up against something sharp. And, but uh, anyways, we got our money's worth. So we'll let this thing down and then we're going to uh, have a little Jeep race or Ford versus Chevy race. My money's on the Ford. pay to play so we had a bit of fun with it yeah. and uh yeah and she lasted through the winter so anyways yeah let's uh we'll put this stuff away and get those two going which one do you want i'm gonna go with the ford oh, that's what i wanted <laughs> so the chevy's the front wheel drive and the ford's all wheel drive they're both fast i always picked the wrong one so it's probably gonna die on me as soon as yeah, i get it so right. god ford, always seems to be good at picking the, the good ones the ford was owned by a girl so it actually smells really good it's not like oh. four thousand cigarette butts that super was terrible. Oh. <laughs> Fast. Terribly stank. So, anyways, all right, let's roll. All right, let's get this thing going. See, it smells good in here. It does smell good in here. Uh, so I've, I'm using the microphone now just because I noticed it was getting windy outside. Why am I even getting in here? I was just gonna ask you what your, yeah. your whole deal was. Well, whatever, let's go for a ride. Sure. Actually, no, I can move my truck first. Yeah. All right. Change of plans. <laughs> Platinum's getting dusty. It's so, so dry out. Let's see if the AC works in this thing. Probably. It is a Ford after all. Not 
quite yet. And park my truck at the front. Let's see. Let's see how this thing rolls now. All right, show us what you got. No air conditioning. No AC, no problem. No. Oh. Right to the rug. <laughs> I feel like I should put my seatbelt on now. <laughs> yeah. Maybe let me in first. Oh, Brakes I'm not going to make you walk, though. No? Grim the track. You hit the double? Yeah, I'm surprised <laughs> no one hasn't yet. Screw up Dallas's dirt bike routes. Yeah. Who's driving a dirt bike out here anyway? I know. Come on. This is what our car thinking? track. Yeah. <laughs> all right, Equinox time. I also. Oh, I'll swing around. We'll get yeah, it all yeah. lined up. I also forgot the drowning GoPro on my truck, so we gotta go get, go back and get it anyway. Well, I'll take you back. Yeah. Well, I'll just take Chevy. All right. We'll do the starting line start first. Yeah. We have to get the mower going down here. It's almost mowing time. Mowing season. No co in here is over. It's on the hood. On the hood, just roasting. Yeah. Nice hubcap still on this thing. Oh yeah, this one smells a little musty. Shot a few darts. This is the one we had to break the window to get in. Alright, no co me. Where's the key? Yeah. Yep. Chris, what are you doing? Yeah, I can't believe you left it on. <laughs> <laughs> so we left the note cool on the whole time the Jeep was running. And obviously the Jeep sucked all the power out. Usually we can get like five to ten boosts. So new plan, we gotta run back to my truck. Good thing we need the drone anyways. There you go. Back to the truck, we'll get the drone and we'll grab the GoPro and some booster cables. <laughs> I thought I had my race car. You know what? I'm taking the Ford, you can have the Chevy. Oh. <laughs> And two. I can't believe how good it smells in here. I think it's this thing. Ah, uh, it's looking around. There's a little bit of freshener right in your face. Oh, yeah. Sneaky. I know my truck doesn't smell like that. <sighs> Big bump right here. Oh, yeah. And tall. <laughs> oh, yeah, I do like this microphone. I know the couple of videos we kind of had some issues with it, so I apologize for that. It's very finicky, but I'm mostly just going to use it for when it's windy now. I do have the dead cat furry sock thing coming for it. It's right now it just has a sponge, so that'll help a lot too. But uh, yeah, you know, I think you have a bit of AC. Not much. Hey, watch the platinum here, right? Yeah. They announced the electric one next week. I might have to get it because gas prices are going through the roof. And it is insane. All right, so let's grab the booster cables. Dust tornado. <laughs> oh, whirlwind. So we got the Scadio drone. We got our... Our cables from Princess Auto and the GoPro. And our crazy driver Chris here. Easy there, all wheel drive. Yeah. Oh, look, a CD player. You don't see those much anymore. Oh, you love taking this way, eh? Yeah. Track time. Gotta get it in. Yeah, come in this corner hotter. Come on, give her the beans. There you go. Yeah. Just hugs get, that get, turn. Get that dirt flying. Rawr, 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 rawr. <laughs> this thing flies, eh? Yeah. I definitely think we need to take all the doors in the hood and the seats Oh, out. absolutely. Because this thing, just as a frame or a chassis, would freaking. I just fly. hope that left front doesn't seize up before you jump in. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully it just rips off before. <laughs> Alright, let's try this again. I guess you got parked a little closer. A little closer. Yeah. Uh, Ford battery. Yeah, I don't know. No. Cracker, it's cracker up. hard right. We'll figure it out. There you go. They're long cables. Keep going, keep going. Yeah, you're good. Perfect. All right, let's roll. Fire away. And we're hooked up. Got nothing. I wiggle those bad boys around. I don't know if I connected it right on mine. This thing's got a weird fuse box connection unit. Almost. I think you gotta wiggle the positive. Oh. 
A quarter tank of gas still. See, most vehicles, they're around 300. That's the Canadian number when they die. Take it off, see if it still runs. Oh yeah, we're good to go. All right. Let's throw that drone in the sky, have a race. I'm not losing this time. You ready to go? I always lose to Brad, it pisses me off. Not losing this time. Three, two, one. You lose the drone? The battery died. <laughs> uh, it landed in the grass. Frick, I don't want to drive around to find it. Because, oh. uh, yeah, hold on. I think you can, sh it'll go to the map. That is hilarious. Always remember to charge your batteries, kids. I forgot to charge them. I launched this thing, it was basically completely dead, so. But anyways, there's, uh, when it does land, it shows a map on your phone where it landed, so. Found it pretty easy. Cars were over there, good thing we didn't run it over. Well, I guess I can grab, all my batteries are half freaking dead, so. Guess I'll grab another one and see if we can do this real quick. All right, here we go, round two. The bump wasn't as bad as I thought, I slowed down for it. I don't need to. Alright. Where's he going? We're gonna go over here and get a better start. Where are we starting? What are you thinking? What is he doing? Are we gonna start there? He wants us to start there. I'm up for that. We starting over there? Huh? We starting over there? We're doing a rolling start. Perfect. Since I'm only two wheel drive. I like it. There we go. Drone out the window. Got full battery on the drone this time. Half battery. Half battery. Batteries have been the, the word of the day today. I forgot to charge them. Whoops. It's gonna be a fun race. This one's saying 51%, so. I almost died there. I know. Oh, 
I was like, you know, I gotta thread the needle. I'm doing it. <laughs> you sure did. I did like a full tail whip. Wow. Dude, everything in the back seat hit the roof. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I get that was scary. oh man. Oh. I knew you'd have a nervous laugh when you finished that. <laughs> oh. oh my god. I couldn't catch it. Wow, that was... That was scary. That was scary, for sure. I lost you in the dust, and all of a sudden... Whoa, right! Whoa. Oh. <laughs> all right, I left it and drive again. <laughs> Can you grab my hat? <laughs> I guess it might be in the front, on the floor. I gotta start putting this thing in park, holy. Dude, okay. So you were ahead of me coming through here. Oh, yeah. And then like it gets really rough through here and there's kind of not a big jump, but there's a big hill and then there's the side of the freestyle landing. And I came in fully committed. I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna hit this and I might roll and hit you. Yeah. <laughs> and I just I hit the first one, I'm like, oh big jump, hit the second one. The whole, Sideways. The whole back end flew over. I'm like, okay, I'm probably gonna clip them. Yeah. And then I'm like my tire's definitely blowing off. No, she's good to go. The old continentals. Yeah. Oh my god. How'd it look for were you filming that? Yeah. How'd it look? I hope I got it. Yeah, I hope you got it. Also, <laughs> I didn't see anything. Yeah. No dust. It was just all dust. Yeah. And all of a sudden, whoa, you're you're rear end, you're completely sideways in front of me. I know I'm only two wheel drive, but this thing picks up quick. And yeah, oh. I just feel like I jumped in front of you and landed sideways. I don't even know. That was <laughs> you were airborne. For sure. <laughs> Wow. That was scary, but it was hilarious. Dude. And then after that, I don't want to get too close to you. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I, you can't see anything. No. It was so freaking dusty. You're the right on the guy's bumper so you can see him? Yeah. Or you got to stay way back? <laughs> uh, well, I think uh, I think that was dangerous enough. I'm sure this video is long enough now. Glad we picked up these vehicles the Ford Escape. We are going to jump both these within the next probably week or two. We're going to have a little fun with them first. Oh, you got to do a race like that again with Brad and Jay. Or oh, 100%. Something. Oh, those yeah. Guys are hilarious to watch. Uh, but uh, yeah, Brad just wrecks everything. I know. It's entertaining. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Give him the Jeep. Yeah, <laughs> but again. definitely when we jump this thing, we're going to cut everything off. I'm thinking even cut the roof oh, off. Yeah, absolutely. Let's shave at least 500 pounds off this, maybe. maybe I don't know how the much. windshield it's... broken out. Yeah, maybe. But yeah, <laughs> doors, roof, back seats. I'm, I'm going to say that's probably. 500 pounds. I know we have an old escape roof over there, and it's at least two, 200, and it's like, it's just awkward, right? But anyways, thank you, Chris, for coming out. That was wild. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Hopefully the audio is a little better. We switched to the microphone after we explode the Jeep there, so hopefully it's a little better. I got to balance it out, play with it, but uh, yeah, I want to see your footage. <laughs> thank you guys again. Have a fantastic day. Follow Chris on Instagram. Don't do anything we wouldn't do. We'll see you guys later.